hi everyone welcome back in this Vue.js video tutorial we are going to learn how we can do login with the Facebook so let's get start so initially uh, let's see uh, I have a main.js file and here I import the app.view file so in this screen we are going to add the login button and uh, do the login successfully so let's get start so now just go to the browser and just write here uh, Facebook login with the view because we need a node module for that and this is a node module that will that will going to help us okay so first of all just install this okay just go to your command prompt and install it okay uh, up to this time it's it's take some time to install so in this time i'm going to uh, do some uh, finish my work so take this uh, first of all we have to import this uh, library to our uh, app.js file so just copy this line and paste here so i'm going to just copy the copy and paste from here most of the things so that we can uh, do it very quickly and uh, after that at the last you can uh, get my code here the link uh, the link is given in the description box here so that you can get this code as an example so import this here and we need the view also in our page so you can install here as view all right so after that uh, we have we have to uh, add the facebook login component so just make here component components uh, and add this file here all right so I think uh, uh, component is also installed in our package in our uh, project so just let's start it again okay after that uh, I'll going to show you with the example from uh, you can get the code from here also so this link is also given in the description box you can get from here so just click on the login component here and first of all you can copy this login uh, Facebook login component and paste it simply here so why I uh, I did not copy from uh, this because there is some issues so uh, whenever you're going to uh, copy the items from here you will get some kind of error then you can compare the code or so this is a much simpler than uh, this code so that I'm going to copy the from here and this is the my git repository so don't worry about that okay I just paste here and after that uh, okay so this is a app ID and you are whenever you are going to use your app then you have to use the your app id here also so if you don't know how to do this then i'll uh, i have the different video for that you can watch this video so now just uh, add the uh, get data function here so you can copy all the methods from here and it will help you a lot okay, and just paste here all right let's use a comma here okay and you can use uh, uh, get data from FP and you will see the console here okay everything is copied here so now just uh, let's check what's going on okay we did not put the methods here I think uh, I need to put the methods function so that uh, without the method function it's not going to work all right now it's it, it should be work okay so method is not a function actually it's a simply object 
let's remove the extra one from here and you can see that we got the error free console here just click on here and you can see that we got the data here okay so in the object you can see that my email id uh, and all these things so just copy it and uh, use it with the console so that uh, it can it will ask you the username and password and you can see that it's really going to work and after that just log in and here you can see that you get the data here id and all these things because we ask only the three things that why it's it's giving only the three things here so it's the id and email uh, email and name so if you want to get more information you can add more fields here so this link is uh, so where is my so this link is my git repository and this is also given in the description box and this module also given in the description box so thanks guys thanks for watching and if you have any kind of question you can ask me in the comment box don't forget to subscribe our channel and please give a big thumbs up on the video